This is my second and final fall haul. This is my favorite time of year, and I have a very difficult time. Everything is on sale now at 50, 60, 70% off. Everywhere you go, the grocery market, um, craft stores, everywhere you go. Lowe's, I was in Lowe's and for light bulbs. What do they have? Fall stuff on sale. But I was good. I chose my four places. I kept my dollars in check. And here is what we have. So we're going to start. I have four for you. We're going to start with the Dollar Tree and the Target dollar spot. That's here on the bed. So first off, when I went back to the dollar store, they had more of these. They had restocked. So um, if you remember, if you recall, last week I purchased the pumpkin shaped. Um, and I like the leaf, so I bought one of those. I didn't go crazy. I just bought one more. So that's that. I loved these uh, kitchen mittens uh, for the kitchen. Um, they're leaves on one side and they're plain red on the other. Um, just, it, they're kind of, kind of busy, but not too. And I love the colors and it's not going to be a whole lot. So I thought they would, they would fit in fine. And they were only a dollar. So I also bought more of their flowers. Um, just a couple picks this time because I always split them when I can to use. But uh, they were just so pretty and colorful. So I got two of those. They had more of the little pumpkins. The little dollar pumpkins. Um, so I got a couple more of those. I have a couple of candy dishes I need to fill for the season. So I bought the candy. And uh, of course I didn't buy it because we like it. I bought it for the color. Go figure. Um, but that will be a little color in a spot someplace. And of course I needed some of these little candles so I got a pack of those and then they had these and they didn't have those when I was there last week um I guess they're made out of some sort of resin uh they're painting and the little designs on the front are kind of 3d which I thought were cute I really love the burlap on the front of this one it says give thanks and I got this other little one here that says happy fall and I believe that was all of my Dollar Tree hauls. So I didn't do too bad. Oh, no. One more thing. I saw these. And um, some are window decals and some are stickers, which I'm not going to use them for. But I thought that I could um, decoupage these on some things. And once I seal them, they'll be fine. They're really cute. They're thankful. I they're also right. purchased this um, gather here with grateful hearts cutting board um, I will never never ever use it as a cutting board but it's pretty um, it has a little um, hanger on it so you can either hang it or you can put it in a stand on a counter or, or in a basket somewhere I just thought it was really cute it began life as uh, at $8.99 and it too was 60% off how about that I think it's cute as you can tell, I love that metal and wood combination. Okay, so next from Michael's, look at this. Look at this little gem. It's a basket with a burlap insert. And look, it goes all the way to the bottom. It's not just on the sides as it can be in some of the um, less expensive ones. It's got bows on both sides. And it started life as $9.99. So I got this little gem for... Oh, about four, four eighty, four something. I'm not a math whiz, but I know it was less than five dollars. Let's just sit it here. Look at that. It's got the two handles. This will become part of my my decor. It will not be put away after the season. It can be used throughout the year, and I thought it was just adorable. So I got that, and then. As you can tell, I'm sitting on the floor showing you these because this is where they were. I got this little pumpkin. Isn't that cute? It's sort of 3D with the 10 pumpkin down here, 10 pumpkin and the leaf scroll. Harvest Blessings, and it has the um, the little bow. And it began life at, let's see, regularly $5.99. So this little boy was uh, under $3. And isn't he cute? 
I just love him. And because they were so cheap, I got two. I love the burlap on this one. Love it, love it. And they're thick and heavy, and they stand up on their own. And like the other, it started life at five ninety nine, and I just, I just got two. Yep. So you'll see those around. And finally, from Michaels, I got this grateful basket. Looks like something you, you know, harvest your garden with back in the day. I think my grandmother had them. They were larger. It has the leather handles. Uh, of course, grateful on the front. Nothing on the, oh, grateful on the back as well. Um, it began life at, let's see. Regularly, twelve ninety nine. It was sixty percent off. This was my most expensive Michaels purchase, and like the other basket, even though it says grateful, it will probably become a part of my everyday decor. I am not just grateful during this, you know, type of time of the year. I'm eternally and forever grateful. I have a lot to be grateful for, and I know that. So this may become part of my my everyday uh, decor. And that was my, my largest spend at Michael's. Okay. Finally, um, Hobby Lobby had a sale. We do not have a local Hobby Lobby, so I have to track them online. I stalk them, actually, because I never, I rarely buy something unless it's on sale. So um, I'm not going to be able to quote you prices on these like I did with everything else because I don't have my packing slip here. But I can tell you that I did not spend over... I want to say $40 because the, the metal things back there were my most expensive purchase, which is um, from Michaels. So um, when the box came the other day, I was I was busy. I opened it to see what was in it, but I didn't unpack it. So we're going to unpack it together. How about that? So let's start. So here, first of all, you saw the garland that I picked up from the dollar store. Um, I'm not complaining. I paid a dollar. And that's what I expect. I know how to use it when it's thin like that. But look at this. Look at how thick and full, long this is. And I want to say, it's well, it started out life at $12.99 because I'm seeing that right here. But you can rest assured that Clarissa, me, I did not pay $12.99 for garland. It was on sale. So I can't remember for how much, but look at how full and thick and luscious it is. It has um, some of the berries in it and it has somewhere, I know I saw pine cones, they're in there too, if you can see that. There you go. And this, was, this is perfect for like doing the top of a mantle. If you have one, I don't, but I have other, other places where I can use it. And again, it was on a good clearance sale. And so I got two of them. I did not, would not ever pay $12.99. But um, I'm so pleased to have it. It'll last for years and it is really full. Okay. Next and my most expensive item from Hobby Lobby. I have wanted one of these for the longest. But um, hadn't found the price that... Um, I was willing to pay for it, so I improvised and used other things. But finally, um, it was on sale at Hobby Lobby, so I got actually two of them. I know where one is going. I have a very dark entryway, um, and so I'm thinking that I'm going to put this on the door on the inside of the entryway with some light flowers or something in it to kind of brighten it up. It, my door does not have windows uh, and that little area doesn't have a window, so it's kind of dark unless the door is open um, to let the sun in, to, to let my doggy lay there in sun sometimes. So I thought that might brighten it up. And they were on sale, and I was happy to get them. I wanted them for a very long time. And on the same note, I've wanted these for a very long time, the little cotton stems. And they are so expensive. I don't know why. I don't know why, but they are. Um, but they were on sale again at Hobby Lobby. So while on sale, I got, I picked up four. Um, the stems are a little longer than I'd like, but I can always cut them. 
Um, I don't know if I will separate any of them because they are so thick and so healthy looking. I may wait until some at some point the price is going to drop other places and you'll find them that aren't as mm -hmm. full and aren't as um, sturdy, sturdy, made as sturdy. So I'm sorry I had to stop. My battery's running low. I was reading what my message was telling me there. Um, so I'm going to finish up real quick. And finally, I purchased these bags of leaves from Hobby Lobby too. Had I known that it would be so full, I probably would have only gotten one. Um, but I did get two, and I know that I'll use them. They began life at $5.99. It's not focusing well because the battery is going down. But uh, again, they were on sale. So I got two of those. And that is my haul, my final haul. I want you to hold me accountable. I am not buying anymore. So you have the... Michael's Hall, okay. We have the Hobby Lobby Hall. I'm so happy with it. I wish we had a local one where I could catch all the sales, but I think I do well online. Um, I have the Dollar Tree Hall. You know, I'm in there all the time. And then I have my Target Dollar Spot Hall. So that's it for this one. And again, I'll ask you, hold me accountable. That's it for fall hauls. And now I'm going to put it all together. And sometime next week, there will be a reveal of my humble abode, my humble homestead. And uh, we'll see what I do with all this stuff. I'll see you then. Have fun.